Hello, this is Vettel121, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Hardcore Remix. And in this episode, we're going to be exploring more of the Shinra building here, because there's some items we can get. Uh, yeah, let's go to the 63rd floor now. I think there's something we can get there. It's the same room with, uh, yeah, we're, we had to open all those doors to get coupons, and we can come over here. And get a glow lance, which is a new weapon for Sid. Although his Venus Gospel is better. So whatever. I'm not gonna worry about that. And now we're gonna go to the 64th floor. And we should be able to find something pretty good in this area too. Oh yeah, and if Earlier on in the game, if you actually talk to these, like, vending machines here, they don't give you a soda, and if you, like, bang, bang on them now or whatever, you can get, like, a mine source and a, uh, speed source from those, but yeah, whatever. Not too worried about that. But, alright, if we come over here to this locker earlier on in the game, we said, oh, a megaphone, that's useless, no point hanging on to that, but yeah, when, when we come back here, we can get the HP Shout, which is Kate Sith's ultimate weapon, and like Cloud's ultimate weapon, it deals damage based on maximum HP as opposed to your current HP. Alright, and I think that's all, yeah, okay, I think now we're going to end up going to the 59th floor, and uh, if you remember earlier on in the game, Tifa was saying, oh, we should use the stairs and try and sneak in to the Shinra building. And I said, screw that. Well, this is basically what we would have been doing instead of actually just busting into the Shinra building. Yeah. Climbing up a bunch of freaking stairs. And yeah, it's going to make you climb up all 60 floors, which is a huge pain in the ass. But, uh, yeah. There's an item we can get on the stairs here, two items, I believe, so... Yeah, let's get them now. They're not too too useful, but I might as well get them anyways. Really, the best uh, weapon you can get in the Shinra building here, actually, in my opinion, is um, Tifa's Master Fist. Probably the best weapon you can get in here. But I'll get the uh, the weapons anyways, just cause. We're here, we might as well get them. We can't come back here anyways, so... Yeah, it's not like I can get them later or anything like that. But yeah, isn't this fun? Climbing a bunch of freaking stairs? Or going down a bunch of stairs? And yes, they're gonna make us do that this for all 60 floors, and it takes a very long time. But, we can get a Behemoth Horn here, which is a new weapon for Red 13. I think I'll be getting his uh, ultimate weapon fairly soon anyways. Uh, yeah, you can't get it until disc 3, but that's pretty close actually, so... Yeah, okay, and then the other item is an Elixir. Now, you can't get the Behemoth Horn here earlier on in the game. In case you're wondering. But you can get it now. I don't know if that second item you get on these stairs is actually replaced by the behemoth horn. If you come back here now. As opposed to picking up the item later. I think the item like earlier might have been like. I don't know. Something like an ether or turbo ether or something like that. But whatever. Yes. This takes a long freaking time. It's bullshit. In fact, I'm probably just edited out from now on.
All right, we are back here in Sector 8 now, and we're going to take the left path. And, oh, okay, this looks a little bit different. Yeah, let's check it out. Oh, what's going on? This can't be! Are you serious? Uh, what? Yes, it is the Proud Clad, and we have to fight this guy again. I've already beaten this guy, like, a bunch of times in the, uh, battle arena, trying to get the ribbon accessory. But with three party members and no handicaps, this guy should, shouldn't be a problem at all, actually. Should have no problem taking this guy out. You sure treated us like dogs till now. You killed many of my precious soldiers. Gahaha, but let's see how you do against anti-weapon artillery. You guys are worthless, but my proud creation is great. Whatever. Your proud your proud creation's about to die. I'll show you the destructive power of the Proud Clod. Okay, man. Whatever. Yeah, we are gonna annihilate this piece of shit. Ow. Wrist laser. Don't hit Tifa. Okay, fine. Hit Tifa. Yeah, it hits pretty hard there. Yeah, I don't really care about her limit breaks right now. Just doing it to do it, and that way I can start doing... Uh, for attack again because that will deal more damage than her limit breaks with the weapon she has equipped yeah curse ring master fist very very useful yeah maybe I should have uh Unequipped Mega All and Yuffie there, but oh well. Ow. Yeah, and I think every time that Tifa goes into critical status, it, like, boosts her weapon damage somehow. I think that's how the Master Fist works. You bitch. Yeah, pain in the ass. This guy shouldn't be too hard though. not some limit breaks yeah 
E fire. Yay. Guy's still alive, huh? And we got him. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't hard. Alright, we get the Ragnarok Sword, new weapon for Cloud, but I already have his Ultima weapon, so I don't really need the Ragnarok. No way, this is the Proud Cloud? Yeah, it's a piece of shit. Whoa! I love how Tifo fist fight anything. Anyways, yeah, we can head this way now. And get some items. Alright, we need an elixir there. And we get a Mistile, which is a very good armor, actually. It might be one of the best armors in the game. Uh, yeah, it has six slots, they're all linked. Uh, as you can see, the defense stats aren't really that impressive and the magic defense stat isn't that impressive but uh, the defense percentage and magic defense percentage are impressive I mean it's like 50% magic defense 60% uh, yeah magic defense which is really really good so yeah in instead of uh, taking magical attacks sometimes you're able to dodge those attacks so yeah that's very useful armor there and yeah for this part right here I'm gonna go ahead and save my game and be right back this way cloud okay Kate Sith yeah I, I put Barrett in my party for right now I didn't equip him or anything I just wanna have what the hell are you kidding me oh no fucking way well anyways we'll be taking these guys on in the next episode of Final Fantasy 7 Hardcore Remix, this is Battle121, and I'll see you next time.